Hello lovely people. So today we're making a skull and we're doing the crystal one. So you actually don't need crystal to make a crystal skull but um, you will need a crystal insert and I actually cut it in the middle to make a two pieces so it can fit in my um, skull mold so I'm just using a small one a uh, small skull mold you can see this is the um, inside so I'm going to pop it like that but first um, let me just push it back in the main thing meant to be so this one is oh let me show you actually what I made so I already made one you can see how nice it looks so this one is a crystal part so when you place that one you have to place this way and stick the smooth part on the mold and this one touch the resin and then, it, and then you get it what you want so I cut it to fit in this mold I have got clue I exactly haven't got clue where I got it from so it was ages ago I got it and then push it down if the resin goes on the back of it that's absolutely fine you can cut it off later on but yeah but as, if you push it in that'll be really um helpful to get what you want so this is how i'm doing mine so let's see my insert is that way and then push it in so yeah so you don't need to worry about too much pushing in but I, I just do it and I am this time the last time I just used the Iridens white um, uh, glitter you can see how nice it is so this is the smooth part and that's the crystal part uh, but this time I'm using uh, resin dye clear resin dye so I got this color, I think it's kind of turquoise. So I got my resin ready here. I'm using Geodiction resin. Let's see how it looks, this color. And then I can, oh, it's kind of greenish one, not the turquoise one. Because it's written in Chinese. I got it from Timu and I don't know. Uh, doesn't really matter so you do need um, when you do this and uh, when you mix it don't add too much because you need it is it will clear anyway but try not to put too much resin uh, too much resin dye so that's all I'm doing right now and then I'll pour in the mold so I got 100 ml I, I won't need 100 ml. It is look like turquoise when you put in. Yes, it does need 100 exactly. So now I'm going to pop this in my um, come on, drop in um, pressure pot. I have got a few bits in well, which wasn't mixed in uh, because I didn't clean the pot and never mind but yeah so I'm pop popping in the pressure pot and I will leave it for around um, um, the PSI normally go for 50 so we see how it goes after that and I'll show you in a bit so it is on 50 PSI as you can see in this bar 50 it's between 40 and 60 so it's 50 psi and i'm going to leave it until tomorrow morning so this is the next day and i am going to release the air
like to open. So I open it and I'll show you demold it. Sometimes what happens, I do have some time to raise in here stick as well. So what I do, I just pull it off and it comes off easily. And then you can take your frozy mold out. Uh, because both are silicone, this one is silicone and this is silicone as well. So it doesn't, it's not that hard to get the resin off. But you can see how deep it is gone. You can see the seed. Here we are. And those are crystal bits. And this one, I'll show you in outside how it looks um, in um, a daylight. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now.